Yeah, I can do that. Hello everybody, welcome to One Shot. Game suggested by Tripleman, released in 2014. Another RPG Maker title, since we love them so fondly on this channel. Uh, it's uh, made by two people, uh, Matthew Velasquez and Night Margin. And it looks really cool. I haven't played it completely blind. Uh, I know very little about it beyond that it's inspired by one of the only the, the only Legends of Zelda games I've actually played, Lights Awakening. Uh, and Yuminiki. So awesome. So it can only be good, right? Unfortunately, the official website for it seems to be down. So I can't really talk about too many of the intricate details, but uh, are we sensitive to flashing lights? No, you're not. Fucking stroke me, baby. Oh, hey. Hello? An odd feeling of deja vu overwhelms Nico. Hey, Nico, my cousin. Oh God, here we go. Oh, we don't have that. Okay, let's let's ad infinitum. A soft, glowing light trickles through the window. I can see this is going to be. A Considerably more RPG than I was expecting. Uh, there's a TP note under the carpet here. Nickel picks it up. Good. Note. That's a scary noise. Okay, right. So this is this is Nico. Uh, Nico doesn't want to go out that way. That's fine. Does Nico want to go back to bed? No. Quite right. A withered plant sits here, stiff and dry. Okay, well I was I wasn't gonna, I was just gonna leave it. Oh that's cool. Lu a pair of luminous yellow eyes to back at Nico. Yeah, they're good looking. Good. Can we get in it? Hmm. Okay, well, I'm happy with that. Hmm. Can we turn on a light, maybe? How would we go about doing that? All of the numbers except 8, 1, 7, and 3 are missing. 8, 1, 7, 3. That sounds like a hint if you ask me. 8, 1, 7, 3. Hooray! Excellent. Computer on. Hey, they've got a uh, Yuminiki. You mean ticky? Flo. Uh, oh, what's that one up in the, the second row? Uh, Space Funeral. Dropbox. My, that's my favourite You Mean fan game. It seems I finally found you. You're both far too late. Nothing left is worth saving. Surely Nico wants to leave. And there's nobody happier to fulfil that request than me. Keep in mind three things. First, your decisions have permanent consequences. Second, you may quit whenever you like. This this is permanent failure and murder. And most importantly, you only have one shot, Stuart. What? What do you mean you're pulling my name from my system? Dick. How dare you? That's a nice touch, I like that. I like that. Breaking the breaking the fourth wall. That's right. Does this mean we can leave now? Okay, good. Hello. Anyone? The TV gives off a dangerous looking spark. Does this mean we're gonna be unable to save the game? 
I'm not sure that it's the end of that. Hmm. What are we looking at here? Panel of woods. A somewhat circular symbol is carved into the central recess, roughly at eye level. Okay, well, I guess we do not have whatever we need to uh, activate that. Did we talk to us? Oh, yeah, it's a spark. What if we use the remote on it? Nah, unless you want to watch spark television. Okay, I'm not going that way. Presumably, we're going to be locked in each of these rooms until we discover a bottle of alcohol. Delicious. Let's get drunk. You and me, Nico. No. Doesn't seem like a good idea. I don't want to combine it. I just wanted to not have the bottle of booze in my hands. There we go. You should have noisy footsteps there, Nico. Uh hmm. Yeah, we saw that already. No. Yeah, that seems like a, a terrible idea if you ask me. Well, a spark sounds like it would be a good way to do that. How could we do that? Maybe if we go through here. No. Take the branch, yes. Excellent. Because the ball already has booze in it, so we don't want to do that. I really love the art style of this, it looks, it looks really nice. Of course, this isn't actually what I wanted to be let's playing this evening. Um, really. Oh, I didn't even think to do that. Good thinking, Nico. Yeah, shove that branch in there. It'll, it'll go lovely. Uh, wet branch, yes. Uh oh. Get in here. Excellent. What's this thing? Something on the ground glimmers in the firelight. It appears to be a small metallic object wedged into a crack in the floor. Nico digs it out. What is it? It is a key. Well, let's go. I got pretty high pitched, still higher pitched, quicker all of a sudden. Um. A large light bulb rests on the ground. The bringer of light, young Nico. I thought something really bad was going to happen there. You cannot fast travel here. Is that is that is that a joke of some kind? You cannot fast travel here. Hmm. Okay. Shove it in there. No. Oh, it looks like a light bulb. Hey, excellent. Um, yes, yeah, so I was going to play the Doom beta, but I couldn't get it to record or stream or do anything I wanted it to do. In fact, it was mostly in uncooperative in all forms. Good. What's going on in here? What's going on in this spooky underground basement? I guess that's where we are. It kind of looks like we're not in the same place at all now. Very broken. Um, yeah, it wouldn't record. It wouldn't work at all. Um, but I've got some other dim stuff I want to do. Oh. Oh, upskirt. Wow. I love the artwork in this. Okay, so we're we're kind of in the big world, I guess. Is this a kind of? It's not a ladder. It's a railway track, some kind. 
What kind of crazy place do you live in, Nico? It's very, uh, very alien. Like an alien mine. Cool music. Well, uh, so what was I saying? Yes, Tim. Um, I was playing it, I wanted to give some first impressions. Oh, uh, but it kind of fucked up a bit. Oh, hi. Ah, ah, how do you say it? Ah, hey, you look another character. Hello there, other character. You look kind of like a, a robot. I got to say, that light bulb, you're here. Hello? Welcome to our world, little one. I am most humbled by your presence. Uh, thanks. Dot dot dot. Dot dot dot. I'm a little lost. Ah, right. I will explain. May I first ask you who you travelled here? I'm not really sure. I woke up and... That was quick. I see! Just as my philosophy foretold. You're the saviour we've been waiting for. You'll be the one to save our world from eternal darkness. Terrible video game. It's not true, actually. It was awesome. Um. Ask me anything you like. The world. Okay, let's ask about the world. Tell me about this world. Our world wasn't always this dim. Nor was it so empty. But time makes for nobody, not even saviours. The world is divided into three regions. You're in the first, uh, they're on the fringe right now, the barons. That spire you see in the distance once held our sun. As you go further towards the centre, you will cross other regions. There should be a map still in this outpost somewhere. Let's ask about light bulb then. What is this light bulb for? Within your hands is our new sun. Many years ago, our sun sat atop that spire and spilled its life into the land. But one day, it ran dry. The surface of this world is abundant with phosphor, an element that stores light. It's provided by us some illumination, but its energy is finite. With the, when the last light of the world fades, the world will die. Okay, computer sounds like a good topic. I know all about computers. In the house, I found a computer. It said something about someone named Stuart. That wanker. Ah, our god. Have you contacted him yet? It wouldn't do that. Huh? The additional name of our god is Stuart. And I'm not sure of the origin of this name. Being the bringer of our son, you have the ability to communicate with them. How I envy you. Close your eyes and try it. Well. Hello? Stuart? Is that your name? Ah, fake him out. Go on then. Wow! I actually heard someone. This is incredible. Always look to them for guidance. You've already received more than you realise. Going, going home. I don't mean to be rude, but I'm not sure about this. I still don't know where I am, or who you are, or how I got here. This is too much. I just want to go home. Your mission is to save our world. I am unable to help you beyond that. Okay, I guess we're done then. Is that all? Yes. I wish you luck. Thanks. Okay, good. So, outpost. You were dicking around outside sub to look like an outpost. Go on, we'll have a look in here then. What's this? Is this a map? Note for a simple cleaning solvent. Note, wear hand protection. Reagents. A rubigo gas and emulsifier any viscous liquid. Step 1. Place arubo gas in a sealed container. Step 2. Without breaking the steel, the, the, the steel, without breaking the seal, Eject emulsifier into container. Shake vigorously, my favourite bit of any recipe. Um, use as soon as possible. If elements begin to separate, further shaking is required. Further shaking is always required. 
because you should be dancing at every opportunity. There's a lot of tiny shrimp swimming in this jar. Did we drink the alcohol yet? Oh, we got an empty bottle. Can we put the shrimps in the empty bottle? Okay, I guess we cannot. Fair enough. Okay, we're in the Barrens. We've got the Glen, the Refuge, and the Spire to go through. And then we will fight the final boss. One, a robot may not ha ha injure a human being or through inaction allow a human being to come to harm. Two, a robot must obey the orders given to it by human beings. They said where such orders would conflict with the first law. A robot must protect its own existence as long as, not as long as such protection does not conflict with the first and second law. Great. Very, very noble rules for a robot. It has to be said. Would never, would never cause anything to go wrong. Ever. Okay, so what about this bit of paper here? I remember being taught in school about the water surrounding the forest stretched until our boundaries of space. Of course, now they say it's the barrens, but I still wonder, what's beyond the void of the sheer cliffs? Is our whole undiscovered world below us? I don't like thinking about it. Yeah, me neither, um, Anonymous. Probably bad. Bad things indeed. A uh, screwdriver? Great. Screwdriver? I don't want you to combine it, I just wanted you to... So if you have something equipped, I guess, it um, assumes you want to do that. Ah! There might be something useful in this box. I wish I had something to pry it open. Screwdriver, mate! Get in there with that screwdriver. Oh, it's not nearly big enough to pry it open. Well, it's worth a shot. Solar batteries restocked. Natural resources of the barns. Harvesting locations. Blue phosphor. Mineral, ubiquitous, organic, biophosphorus southeast, biophosphorus sap southeast, uncommon, blue limestone, ubiquitous, bauxite north, iron ore north, shale <laughs> rock north, arable gas northwest. Let's go on. So was it southeast, did it say? I've already forgotten. <laughs> southeast, right? Okay, southeast, easy. Southeast and northwest is what we're going to do. Tiny shrimp. Great. The extra cash. Start working at the close today. Five positions available. First come, first serve. Doesn't allow as much going for work around here. Not unless you want to follow El Roboto about. Very des desolate and run down. I guess these jars are like light sources of some kind for the poor people who are not lucky to be carrying around massive balls. This appears to be a battery, but it's too heavy to take. Revolutionary self-charging solar battery, five year warranty included. Simply place your self-charging battery in sunlight to charge at an incredible rate. No external power needed. Excellent. Unknown date. Another minor fell into the best today. That's the third this week. Maybe it's not so much of a concern for you. We need better safety conditions. This is unacceptable. Please tell that girl to hurry the hell up with those robots. We can't afford to lose any more men to easily presentable accidents. Preventable accidents, not presentable. You do not present people with accidents. Can we eat the shrimp? I'm sure they're delicious. And uh, what does that say? Light from the jar this jar of shrimp is charging the battery. Ah, uh, okay. Okay, I see. I don't really, but it's very interesting. Hmm. What did we get in those? You must get night. Okay, I got that. Yeah, we got it. We got to do that. Qu quitting the game before you reach the end. Come, Nico. You only have one shot. I wish you luck. Thank you. Did we? What's in here? 
Yeah, we did this already. Okay, so does that mean we can't save the game? We're, we're, we're gonna have to play this in uh, one sitting. That's perhaps a little bit more than I was hoping to commit to. Uh, but we can we can we can roll with that. I can't believe that that's how it's gonna be. I cannot believe that's what we're up against here. What's this? Hmm. That looks like a little stone. Maybe that's a. Uh... No. Hmm. So what did we need to get? Some things for the acid or whatever it was. Cleaning reagents. That's right. Very pretty. Old little twinkling things. Where did that keep happening? I wonder what the significance is. I kinda, it's kind of like day or night. Cycles are changing. Oh, oh that's like a thing. It's a pair of gloves. They're a bit heavy. Mineral refinery. It looks like a solar panel. Light bulbs powering these machines. Garbage compactor. Specially designed for heavy duty crushing of metals. What's this thing? It's whatever it is, it's beyond repair. Hey, sweetie. Six more weeks until you can come home. Are you excited? Surely, the thought, surely you're sick of living in that awful capsule wall thing. I bet you can't wait to sleep in a real bed and eat real food again. Right back soon. Love, Mum. Hmm. Hmm. Very interesting. What? What? Getting fucking lost. Seriously lost. Oh dear, this is like a maze already. Oh, there's a the letter there, we better read that. There's something weird about the robots who get sent to work near the fence. They always look less rusty and shinier than the newest models. Is that the result of the acid gas? Or am I just seeing things? You're just seeing things, man. That's crazy. Stop being so crazy. What about... No, we're supposed to go southeast. Which we've failed at quite royally, because this is definitely not southeast where we're travelling. But that's fine. I think we can, we can work around that. It's like in Yumi Nikki, you just have to keep travelling in a direction until the opportunity to travel southeast presents itself. What's this thing? A metal safe. I, I don't think I've seen any codes anywhere. Not since the remote, anyway. I see, you made progress, Joe. But that stops here if you don't stop to consider this. This world is falling apart. It's possible the information you seek is an entirely different plane of existence. No, I, I don't understand. Information is contained within documents. Where on your machine would you find documents? Uh, where on my machine would I find documents? Uh, documents. Aha! Look at this. Documents. What the hell is all this? Let's close some of these things down. We don't need to look at that. Uh, I hope that's visible, is it? Yes, right. Uh, dear, whatever the fuck all that is, today is a whole load of gibberish. This is my final letter to you, and I'm afraid I must make it brief. I've written, I've left you my journal. Written in a language that, whatever that means, that few, few, you but us could understand. Ah, you can kind of read it, look. There's letters in there. 
Read it and you'll know everything. I also left you a mask in case the toxic fumes ever spread. Look for a large safe in the quarry to the east. Safe, stay safe. Do not look for me. The code to the safe is 489609. Easy! Let's try that. 489609. Whoa! It worked! How did you know that, sir? I'm a fucking cheater, aren't I? There's a gas mask in here. Also, some weird looking book. It's written in a language I've never seen before. Oh, yeah. Good. What is that? Good question. Can we touch this again? It's empty, okay. Reality is breaking down around you, young Nico. Well, we didn't... We didn't get the thing that we're looking for, but we got something else instead. A mask. Always useful. The saviour is not coming and I am afraid of the darkness and the darkness only get darker and darker and darker. Taking my leave now. Farewell. To all. I'm so sorry. Yes, indeed. I wonder if we get worried that this game is just like writing arbitrary files to my documents. It seems a bit peculiar. Didn't realize RPG Maker games had the capacity to do things like that. Fair play to you. Fair play to you, young Nico. Oh, hey, look, it's uh, it's another robot. The amount of noxious fumes emitted by the natural gas vents caught our team off guard. Such a high concentration, it seemed impossible that anything with lungs could exist. It remained quite a mystery until our scientists realised the shrimps scattered in the pools were actually consuming it. Without those shrimps, life wouldn't be. It's kind of depressing to think we can't thank them. Still, we wore those masks to be safe, especially around active vent sites. The replacement of our workforce by robots soon rendered ta masks unnecessary. I wonder what happened to them all. I can't even remember where I placed mine. It's probably in the safe, innit? I've got it right now. Dear Silver, I heard the news about the mine. I can't imagine what you're feeling. It's been two weeks. I know it must be hard, but you must leave soon too. It's only a matter of time before the robots are recalled. At least let me know when you got my message, okay? Kip. Hey Kip! I got a message. What's in here? Medical tools? Most of them are broken and rusted beyond use, but this plastic syringe seems to be okay. Plastic syringe, you say? Oh, look at that, we got a gas mask on. Awesome! We look kind of scary with that on. Fancy that, within the space of a week, we've got two gas masks in the past. A light bulb. So. Are you the messiah? That's what I've been told. I was expecting someone taller. I mean, what are you? Some kind of cat? No offense, but a tiny little thing doesn't exactly scream savior material to me. But that person says there's no mistake, so I guess I don't have a choice. And I'm not a cat. Huh. Alright, cat eyes. If you ask me, you're probably better off just leaving, letting the world die naturally. You've seen it, right? It's literally falling apart. Not even bringing back the sun can change that. Then, but I suppose you know, you can't just up and leave, huh? That's what I asked the person who told me. You couldn't help. Let me think about this for a moment. You are headed towards the spire, yes? I think so. That's where I'm supposed to put the light bulb, or sun, isn't it? Uh-huh. Way up top. If that weird robot's prophecy is correct, that place holds a force that nobody could comprehend. Maybe it'll send you back home after you do what you're supposed to do. Oh! Why well, he looks so surprised in that little picture. Don't take my word for it, though. <clears throat> Fine. I, I, I won't. I'll play chess instead. A chess set. Guess it must be pretty boring to be here alone. 
You certainly can't play chess. Let's play chess against yourself. You have anything else to say? What's inside of the spire? I don't know. Nobody's ever entered it before. At least, nobody history knows. Then, who built it? Built? As far as I know, as far as anyone can tell, it's been there since the beginning of time. I see. I don't see how you can, with those big old eyes of yours. You're coming on to me. Yeah, right. <clears throat> Crazy woman. Good, well, we've, we've done that. Can you go up this way? No. It seems to be kind of fixed in the kind of transitions. It doesn't look like you can just kind of explore randomly anyway. Cool background. I'm loving it. Oh, what's this? Oh, look at that. It's like a, it's like a big crane. Oh, a camera. It's broken though. It's beyond repair. How unfortunate. So this game has the ability to just write files wherever it wants, but it's starting to look like it doesn't have the ability to... Sure, I would suffocate here. Well, put the mask on, you fucking cat. Come on, get the mask on. We've been through this. Good. I'm glad. So we found the, the gas area. And we just about killed poor Nico with our actions. Marching him into the, the gas. Well. I have been trying to record lots of different things this week. Things other than this. The horizon glows a faint green. Good. I guess. Green's good. Is this back where we started? It isn't. But there is a bed. I'm sure you've seen this particular bed before, Stuart. I don't know what you're suggesting. I certainly haven't been in bed with any uh, people with cat's eyes, no. If Nico sleeps here, you can safely take a break from the game without consequences. The game will, aut will exit automatically and can be continued later. Don't be alarmed. I'm a little tired from walking. Is it alright if I take a nap? Yeah. Yeah. Absolutely, Nico. Bye, game. Um, and I guess we're back to looking at the note. Okay. Uh, well, it seems like a very natural point to stop. Very well placed. Uh, wow. That was fucking awesome. Holy shit. Uh, that was, um, one shot. That was one shot. Uh, one shot. That was one very long shot at one shot. Uh, thank you very much for watching, everybody.